there'll be times when you want to get the thigh to tighten around the dog's leg more than it will, it apparently will. And what you're gonna wanna do is, and the way you'd know that, first of all, um, is to tighten it around the, do do the top dorsal brace strap along the dog's thigh. What will happen is that the two edges of the um, neoprene, red neoprene, will meet and they will abut and they, won't, they will want to buckle or they won't want to close any further. So what we would do, instead of having that happen, is we would take the Velcro out of the buckle and the Velcro will pull back away, it's stuck down, but it'll pull back away from the neoprene and what we'll want to do is to apply some tape under where the Velcro would be and so it won't stick down to the neoprene and that will allow the neoprene to overlap itself. So we're going to put two strips down just to make sure it doesn't stay. And then we can put the Velcro strap back through the buckle. And when we tighten it now, what will occur is it'll allow it, as you can see, to overlap by um, at least the distance of the length of the tape that's shown here. So now I can get it to be that tight instead of having it buckle and not tightening around the back of the thigh of the dog. And you can see that it's now overlapped and it's very comfortable because the inside is all lined with lycra and it's a very smooth soft material so both of these edges are now overlapped so we've got an extra inch and a half to two inches of further shortening you can also add it to the other side under the buckle section if you'd like in the same manner by just pulling the buckle back and putting some tape underneath it right here so it doesn't stick down. You can put that back pretty far and you can actually get it to overlap even more at the back of the thigh. So if you have dogs with narrow thighs and this is the size brace they needed, that's what you have to do to get it to overlap and it will function just fine that way.